봐도 눈이 이겨낼 강한 발이 있어 전능하신 하나님께서 너와 언제나 함께 하시니 
Twelve Spies. Numbers Chapter Thirteen, Page One Hundred Twenty Four. Finally, the Israelites arrived near the Promised Land. God told Moses to send spies there. Moses picked twelve men. He told them. Find out what the people are like. See if the land is good. The spies returned and said, "The land is beautiful. It is filled with plenty of food, but the people there are big and strong." Joshua and Caleb said, "Do not worry. God has promised us this land. He will give it to us." The rest of the Israelites did not agree with Joshua and Caleb. Then God said to Moses, "The people do not have faith with me; they cannot enter the land." So for the next forty years, God's people wandered in the desert. The end. Hello, 사랑구. Welcome to our daily devotion. Let us start with a prayer. Kido so, dear God, thank you for today. Let us listen to your word. Let us have faith. Let us obey, and let us get blessed by you. And through us, let your name be glorified. Thank you. I pray everything in Jesus' name. Amen. Okay. So last time we learned about God giving ten commandments and a tabernacle, a church, to the Israelites, and God also promised them that God will give a good blessing land to them to live. So Moses sent twelve spies. To go to the promised land to see how the land is, and for forty forty days they were looking and came back, and ten people spies said there are big strong giants living in that land, and if we go there we will die. So they said we cannot go there. They did not believe in God's promise. And other two people, Joshua and Caleb, said this. Let us read our Bible verse for today. This Numbers chapter fourteen, verse nine. Let us read together. Only do not rebel against the Lord, and do not fear the people of the land. For they are bread for us. Their protection is removed from them, and the Lord is with us. Do not fear them. Amen. Joshua and Caleb said, "No, even though big strong giants live in there, God is here with us, and God will keep His promise." So we can go and live in that promised land. They believed in God, even though there were giants living in there. And because these ten people, spies, did not believe in God's promise, God said, "You guys will not go receive that promised land for forty years." If you don't believe in God, if you keep complain and keep worry, God will not give it to you. It's like this: when your mom promises you to take you to Disneyland, and that day came, your mom says, "Let's go to Disneyland," and you say, "No, mom, you don't have money. I don't have money." We cannot go to Disneyland. And your mommy is saying, "No, I do have money. Let's go." And you keep saying, "No, you don't have money." 
And your mommy is saying, let's go to Disneyland. And you're saying, no, I think there's a lot of people in Disneyland right now. If we go, we can, we're gonna do, all do is wait and we cannot ride the roller coasters. I don't wanna go. And your mom is saying, no, there's no people, let's go. And you keep making excuses. You keep worrying, being afraid. And your mom will say, ah, never mind. Let's, I'm not taking you to Disneyland. Forget it. God is saying, let's go. I promised you and I will make you enter and live in that promised land. I will fight for you. I will protect you. But this 10 spies is saying, no God, there's this giant, strong giants living in there. And I think you God, you cannot protect us. I think these giants are stronger than you. I think they're gonna kill us. We cannot go in there. We cannot live in there. They keep worrying. They are not believing in God. They are not believing in God's promise. So let us not worry, be afraid, because God is saying He will be with us. He will protect us and He will bless us. So let us have faith like Joshua and Caleb who does not worry but who believes in God's promise. Amen. So let us pray. Dozo. Dear God, even at this coronavirus and even at many things happening to us, let us not worry let us not be scared, but let us see you, God, that you being with us, fighting for us, and keeping your promise to us. Let us have faith like Joshua and Caleb. Let us be in peace, and let us just follow you. I pray everything in Jesus' name. Amen. Today's craft, let's open up a new craft book. Promised Land Pathway. God said the people were still not ready. Find the Promised Land. Start from here and you need to end up here. High up. Jericho had high walls. Circle one is high in each picture. The 12 spies. Or search. And the 12 spies, memory verse, fill in the blank, and true or false. Circle the correct words. Okay. Have fun. Bye-bye.